Each victim was killed by a puncture wound at the base of the skull inflicted by a five-inch instrument. It went straight into the medulla oblongata, immediate, according to the coroner, painless execution. These photos are all post-mortem. You know, a couple of them almost look alive, don't they? Consistency number two, no mistakes. Crime scenes so far have yielded no evidence of DNA, hair fibers, shoe prints, nothing. No witnesses either. Ward lived in a secure building with a doorman, still no signs of forced entry. On the site front, it's unheard of. There's no geographical, chronological, or astrological pattern to the murder. No robbery. Oh, it's nice, though. I think we got a pretty good handle on this case. John. John. Yeah. Robert Ellis, the kid in Mount Pleasant. He was eating ice cream. He was. Where do you want to start, John? Well, how about the beginning? 